everyone. It's number 38, Alec Calvaruso, uh, calling in from Livonia, Michigan, and this is the quarantine call-in. Uh, what have you been up to during quarantine? My uh, schedule is pretty much the same thing every day. I wake up, go uh, work out at my new workout facility, uh, go to work, and then hopefully come home and get around to golf in if I can. Uh, what shows have you, have you been binging on? I'm not really big into series, but I do watch a lot of movies with my friends. Um, what is your major in school? My major is business management. What's the best part about playing hockey at RPI? I would say for sure the fans, the atmosphere of games uh, is unbelievable every night and it's something we look forward to always for the weekends. My best hockey memory uh, would probably be last season. Um, Winning the Clark Cup and the USHL with Sioux Falls. It was pretty memorable. Got to meet a lot of great people and it was just a great year. The player I looked up to the most growing up would have to be Carey Price, just because he's a goalie and I always wanted to be a goalie and I think it's I think it's a great position and a great guy to look up to. Uh, the team I grew up rooting for, probably the Detroit Red Wings just because they were local. They've been struggling a bit lately, but I always kind of stick with them and uh, follow up on their games and root for them. Current active favorite hockey player would for sure be Carey Price still, just because he's so technical and great position and just everything he does on and off the ice is something to look forward to and look up to. The sport you would play if you were not a hockey player would most likely be soccer. I uh, grew up playing soccer, my dad always played soccer, and it's something that's just been around the house. Best non-hockey athlete in the world, I'd probably say Tom Brady because of how many championships he's won and everything that he does uh, on the field, away from the field, he's just a great guy to look up to. Um, plans after graduation, I'd obviously love to keep playing hockey after, uh, after school, but if that doesn't work out, I'd like to go into some type of law enforcement, but specifically I'd like to go in the FBI if I can. Uh, favorite non-hockey hobby probably would be fishing. Uh, I like to go fishing a lot with my friends or golf. Golf is kind of an everyday thing here and we got into it a lot this summer and you know, we've been getting out whenever we can. My favorite food uh, would probably be sushi. I like to get that a lot and treat myself at least once a week. Favorite movie, probably be Step Brothers, kind of a classic. Um, favorite TV show, I like That 70s Show and uh, Family Guy. Uh, dream vacation spot, uh, probably Italy. Um, I went to Sicily a couple summers ago with my sister and it was awesome and I'd love to go back. Uh, celebrity crush, Jennifer Aniston. Dogs or cats, dogs for sure, not a, not a big cat guy. Um, do you have any pets? Yes, I have a golden retriever named Bella. She's very mellow. Uh, it's a little fired up when people come near the house, but she's, she's a great dog to have around. Sure. If you could have dinner with anyone from history, alive or dead, who would it be? Probably my grandpa. Um, I used to hang out with my grandpa a lot. He passed away three years ago, so it'd be awesome to have dinner with him and see him again. Funniest teammate, probably Nick Bowman. Uh, best dressed teammate, probably be Owen Savory. Uh, most serious teammate, probably give to Simon Shelberg. He's awesome on the ice, away from the rink. Whatever he does, he's always professional and always gives it all. Worst dressed teammate, uh, I gotta give it to Otto Vila Lepinen. Smartest teammate, Nick Bowman. If you were stranded on an island with a teammate, who would you pick? I'd pick Mason Klee. Uh, he's a great guy, we've always got along, and he was actually in my house recently, uh, drove through, come back through Michigan, dropping off his brother at school, and we had some fun here, and I think he would be a good guy to get stuck with. <laughs>